Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue with VSOD with error code 0XC000185. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all, in the basic step, I suggest you to completely remove any external device attached to your system such as any external keyboard, external mouse, any PlayStation, Xbox or any external hard disk. Once you are done so, go ahead and try restarting your PC and check if the issue has been fixed out or not. If this doesn't fix, let's proceed with the advanced troubleshooting steps. At this point of time, you need to restart your PC in the troubleshooting mode. To do so, press and hold the power button of your laptop or your computer until your system completely turn off. Once it is turned off, go ahead and again press the power key to restart your PC. And once your system starts and screen started to display, go ahead and again hold and press the power key again to turn off your PC using this power key. Repeat this step three to four times until your screen diagnosing your PC or preparing automatic updates. I'll go ahead and perform the same steps with you. As soon as the screen started to display, I'll go ahead and turn it off. If you have done it correctly, you can see the same screen preparing automatic repair. Now click on the option advanced options, click on the option troubleshoot, again click on advanced options and click on the option command prompt. Login with your account. Now in command prompt, you first need to verify the windows installation drive. So type in dir space the drive letter where your windows is installed, which is generally C, double dot and then hit the enter key. Now the error means windows installation drive is not C. Now type in dir d double dot and hit the enter key. Now here you will get the program files folder, which means that my windows installation drive is drive D. Now type here command chkdsk space slash f space windows installation drive at my end it is d so make sure you type in the correct installation directory double dot and then hit the enter key wait for it to process the command now once it is done type exit now go ahead turn off your pc and restart to fix out the issue of error code 0 xc Double zero double zero one eight five. Now, if this failed to work out, let's proceed with the next step. Again, you need to open this particular screen and click on the option troubleshoot, advanced options, and again click on the option command prompt. And this time, type a command boot rack space slash fix boot and then hit the enter key. If it is giving you error, type in boot sect space slash nt60 space sys and hit the enter key again. Now, re enter the command boot rack space slash fix boot now type second command boot rack space slash fix mbr and thirdly is boot rack space slash rebuild bcd and hit the enter key now wait for it to scan the windows installations in your system at my end it is saying that the total identified windows installation is zero so at your end if it has found one or two you need to press the a key to completely fix this particular issue. After typing the A key, hit enter and once the command is properly processed, again exit and restart your PC to fix out the issue of error code 0xc000185. And if all this method fails, in next step, again head over to troubleshoot, command prompt and first of all, re-verify the installation drive of your windows. So again type dir c double dot and hit the enter key which means there is no program files in c drive so i'll type in dir space d double dot and hit the enter key now program files are in my d drive as it is shown right over here now type a command bcd boot paste the installation directory of your windows at my end it is drive d double dot forward slash windows space forward slash s and space forward slash again the windows installation drive letter which is letter D at my end, double dot and then hit the enter key. Now you need to copy the last command which is bcd boot c windows p and paste right over here by pressing the control plus v key. Now at this point of time, replace the letter c with your windows installation drive. 
at my end which is letter D. Once you have done this, hit the enter key. Now, it can see the boot files are successfully created which means that your bootloading files are created which in turns help you fix out the issue. Go ahead type in exit. Now, go ahead and turn off and restart your PC and this will completely fix out the issue of error code 0xc 00085. Now, if all the method fails, the last hope you have is to do a clean installation and then recover your Windows data. To do so, I have a dedicated tutorial for you. Here is a dedicated tutorial to completely reinstall Windows in your PC. I will share link of this tutorial in the description of this video. Once you have installed the Windows in your PC, here is another tutorial which will help you completely recover your data even if your hard disk is completely formatted. Watch both the tutorials in your system and then it will completely fix out the issue of BSOD error code 0xc 00085. So as of now, this is all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.